Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and today in this video, I'm gonna show, how to fix internal drives shown as external on Mac OS. So before starting, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, then please go and subscribe to our channel and stay connected for the latest updates. So without a further ado, let's get started. Currently, as you can see, the primary disk on this Hackintosh is being detected as external media, although the connection type is PCI Express. To fix this, you'll need Hackintool, to get the device path of your drive, and open Core Auxiliary Tool, or any Config PList editing tool. To edit the Config PList, now, open Hackintool, and then go to the PCIe section. Here in PCIe section, get the device path for the internal drive which is being shown as external. Here my internal drive device is a WDSN730. After getting the device path, close Hackintool, and then mount your ESP, and open the config plist. After opening the config plist, go to the DP tab, and here create an entry under PCI lists, and then add the copied path. Now enter the following values to the next section. Now after making the changes, quit plist editor while saving the changes, and restart your PC, and now your internal drive will be detected as internal. Here as you can see, the drive is now being detected as internal. If your drive is still being detected as external, open your config plist, and then enable a quirk, external disk icons, under kernel tab under quirk section. This quirk is mostly required for the drives with SATA connection. After enabling this quirk, save your plist, and then restart your PC, and the issue will be fixed. So that was it. Hope it was useful. Consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions, just comment down below. Thanks for watching and have a great day ahead.